Hi friends and welcome to the general tarot message for the day. I hope all of you are doing well. Thank you for tuning in to my channel. So let's see what pops up in the energies for all of you. We do have the full moon coming on Sunday. Um, we also will be in Leo season, Sun and Leo. It might even be that way already. Um, we're out of Cancer season <laughs> and now we're in Leo season. With the first full moon on the 21st. I saw the moon last night. It looked pretty full to me. Okay, slight adjustment there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Spirit and angels, please show us what are the energies for the general collective. What do they need? To Four of Wands. You're kidding me. I really shuffled pretty hard. <laughs> um so we have stability in the home, stability in the career, enough for you to take time off, you know, enjoy yourself, go have a good time. Um, this is what it's about. The challenge is the empress. Now that can be um, a person of value. It can also be standards, um, like really, really high standards, uh, love, a person, a mother, a matriarch. Okay, there's something that you want stabilized, four of coin. I'm sorry, seven of coin. It is stable. You've invested quite a bit, but what do you get out of that situation? Um, you could be missing somebody here or feeling like um, you invested a lot into a, you know, a relationship. A king of the earth, a Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo is showing up here as part of this issue or around the issue. You feel like you want to build. So if you consciously know you have a lot to choose from, either in your career, whatever you're doing, you consciously know that this is not the end all be all, like there could be more for you here. The future shows, so we have seven, 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 seven of swords. There's a strategy to develop, which is not a bad thing. Seven of swords typically means somebody hides information and uses it for later or for their purpose. And some people can say that's stealing, that's theft, but can also be a strategy. Um, okay. This is a match to your energy, this person. You're the queen of the earth. This person's the king. They have a lot of burdens or a lot of things that they are working on on their own without help. It looks like you want stability. You don't want to all of a sudden up and change your life around because your fear is all of a sudden going in a new direction the outcome is good the outcome is a 10 a very solid foundation not a lot of change with the ten of pentacles it's a lot of, a lot invested and a lot is there creating a firm foundation in your in this this certain scenario there is a certain new offer around this energy, though, which could be a job, money. There's loyalty and an ace of coin. So somebody's coming in slow, offering this coin. You or somebody else could be giving advice or receiving advice. Somebody could be brutally honest with you. 777. That's kind of like, I know I have a lot of choices. I don't have to commit to this if I don't want to. I can if I want to. Seven of Pentacles. There's a connection to a past energy that is like yourself. They may give leadership. If they're the king and you're coming in as a queen, you may be looking for someone to give you guidance. Um, so we have a Ten of Swords with the Hermit. Something is discovered that brings freedom. So we have the Ten of Swords, the Hermit, the Freedom of the Fool. 
So there's a, an important discovery here. Bottom of the deck, wow, Five of Swords. Similar to my Aries Daily, not the same, but similar. There's something about the situation where someone's angry, mad, blaming someone else. Um, they feel very resentful. Four of Cups, someone acts like they don't care, or maybe they don't care. It's It's just a very, I can't be bothered. And then we have an Emperor, it could be an Aries. We have the Devil behind it with Justice and temperance. Someone was tolerant of a situation for quite a while. They were very tolerant uh, because they're tolerant and then justice comes in and then and then here's this maybe it's like a revenge kind of thing like they're mad. Um, emperor here a person in power or Aries or power person of power Four of Cups, not caring, and then Four of Swords. Five of Swords, kind of still mad about something. Okay, you have 777 with the Goddess as part of the issue here. What is the Goddess? That's the Four of Cups. Someone who just doesn't really care very much. They're like, no thanks. Rejecting an offer. Ooh, Ten of Swords. This makes someone feel bad. Um, why does the Seven of Swords come up? Ugh, the Five of Swords. So this is this. So we have this resentful attitude of someone who has a strategy to go around. Why are you Seven of Coin as the Moon? Unknown or something not known. Not certain whether this person will commit or not. Why is there a Seven of Cups here? Why is there... Oh, confusion due to choices. Oh, well, we got a Seven of Coins. There's a real... Something you could invest in. You could do if you wanted, but there's a Five of Wands. There's conflicting... People are not on the same page. Um... You're looking at the value, but there's a lot of arguing or something like that around the situation. Why are you afraid of a two of wands? Or you want a two of wands? It's something about this knight of coin coming in with this offer. Like you're given another offer. How does this affect the person around you? Ten of wands. Eight of swords. They feel like they're isolated, trapped, or alone. So how does the outcome become a Ten of Pentacles for the viewer? How does the outcome become a Ten of Pentacles for the viewer? How does the outcome become a Ten of Pentacles for the viewer? Oh, you've got to be kidding. Look. This is seriously magic. This is like a magic. I'm going to go take a magic class, I swear. Or maybe this is just pure spirit. I mean, so. Okay. <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> we got a four of wands underlying. You're going to get your passion, your wish, your partner, your job. The fact that somebody may have rejected you, overlooked you, I feel like you don't know that it's still being considered. Seven of Pentacles is like it's being considered. The resume's on the pile. But there's a very competitive you know, environment here. Um, there's more than one person that wants the same thing. I feel like two five of wands might be unfair or like not. I mean, yeah, so other people want what you want. I don't know. What is your energy here with the Queen of Pentacles? What is the viewer with the Queen of Pentacles? Could have Earth energy in your chart. The, the new pentacle. You could be buying something new, investing in something, paying for something. Um, buying a house with the Ten of Pentacles. Seven of Cups is part of the the issue on your mind is like there's so many things that I like 
there's multiple factors going through my mind. How I feel about it is multiple ways, but I do want to invest. Why does the moon come up as part of the investment? There's research. You don't have all the information and somebody comes to you with a, you know, a friendly offer here. Page of Cups, not really knowing or understanding, so maybe doing your own research. What is the moon? Okay, it could be a mom or mother figure. Again, we have the Seven of Cups. We have the Empress coming out as part of the issue. The Goddess of Material Wealth, Abundance, Fertility. Um, and it can be a person, like a maternal figure. Bottom of the deck, we have a Queen of the Pentacles, a Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. Um, this this person is your energy. It's you. Um, what's going on here? An Emperor. An Aries. Somebody very strong, very stable. Um... Wow, okay, so I just split the deck and cut it, and I got a Nine of Cups. Could be some wish fulfillment here coming your way. Oh, and freedom from this energy. Freedom from this energy of having to hide or having to be very careful. So let's get an Oracle card. I just want to get one or two. Okay, spirit and angels, show us what's coming up for the collective. What do they need to see or acknowledge? Sudden wealth. You're kidding. Well, you do have a ten of pentacles over there. It's underlying. Somebody's thinking about you. All right, this is what I have for the collective. Thank you so much, and I will see you in the next video.